welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Lachelle Trends and in today's video I'm coming to you with another wig review on this unit you see me wearing right here this unit was sent to me from hot beauty hair I will have them and this unit linked in the description box below and if you enjoy this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to hit that notification bell as well you guys because I post weekly so let's go ahead and jump right into the video Okay, y'all, so again, I received this hair from Hot Beauty Hair, and it came in this cute packaging right here. How cute is this box and this bow? So, y'all, let's open it up. I'm not going to lie. Your girl is super nervous about this one because it is a shorter unit. So, girl, oh, this is so cute. It comes um, on the top was this uh, pick, and I literally have my pick sitting right here, but this one is even better because it's pink. And then here is the um, package that the hair is in. It also comes with, what is this? Their packaging is just really on point, you guys. So this is like a little, kind of like a pencil case. And inside uh, is some clips. Don't mind my nail too, because my nail is broken and I look a hot mess. Um, here comes a band some clips and you already know the drill a edge brush oh okay hold on and we got some tweezers how cute is this the packaging is everything you guys and then it also comes with a wig cap oh and it has like some stock card at the bottom and your, your nail, my nails ain't letting me be great Okay, it just says Hot Beauty Hair. Thanks for choosing Hot Beauty Hair. Um, it's like a thank you card and a hair care card um, on the back. So, y'all, they get 10, uh, 10 stars. What is it? Five stars? Five stars <laughs> for the packaging because it's just everything. And this is the unit. Ooh, girl. Okay, so I believe, if I'm not mistaken, Ugh, girl, I can't talk. If I'm not mistaken, this is their dark chestnut um, color. And I forget the style of curl pattern that this is. But again, y'all y'all already know I'm going to have the details once we jump further into the video. But get into it. Y'all, I'm nervous. I have never had like a short curly unit like this before. But when I first went natural, my hair... Um, was kind of like this or whatever of course not this color but yeah so girl it brings me back back to memories okay so this is just more cute packaging more details so again that was the color and the curls this is the inside of the wig you guys see the elastic band um, it also has some clips um, at the top girl okay one in the middle and one at the bottom I believe I'm feeling some adjustable straps as well am I yeah so that was adjustable straps I don't know if you guys can see it but yeah that is what the inside is looking like y'all so far this wig is so heavy so that's good because this is a full unit or that means that should mean that this is a very full unit it looks very full and it is um heavy so i'm liking that already because i already know this is about to be full volume the pick girl i can't wait so let's go ahead and just put her on so as you guys already saw, there is no lace to this unit, so we don't need to tint, we don't need to pluck, we don't need to bleach. Like this install is just very simple, you guys. All I'm doing is putting it on my head, and then I'm just going to begin to fluff it out. I'm not even using any product. I mean, I just want this install to be very simple. If you guys want to add some product while you're fluffing it, you can, but I'm literally just fluffing it out, and that is all.
now I'm just going in with some pins and this is just to push back the hair out of my eyes this is totally optional but it is a little long in the front so I do want to be able to see so yes it's So here is what we are looking like and girl the wig is very pretty now it will take your girl some time to get used to it because I'm not used to the tight curls and the fluffiness and whatnot but the wig is very pretty y'all like I'm really feeling it again I'm gonna get used to it but I really think the wig is very pretty the curls are nice the color is nice like y'all so anyways let me go ahead and turn around so you guys can see the back So that was the back, you guys. So let's go ahead and get into the details of this unit. So I'm going to pull it up on my phone. So this is their double drawn rose curl wig. I'm not sure of what length I have, but I'm pretty sure it's eight inches. Um, I do know I have the dark chestnut brown color. And it says that this is 100% human hair, 180% density. It has no lace. The wig cap is medium size, 22.5 inches. The texture is rose curl, fluffy curl. The weight is 200 grams. The hair color is natural black. Oh, well, it does say on here that it is eight inches. Um, at least, it lasts at least one year. It can be dyed. It has four combs in the inside and it does have an adjustable strap and it can be a glueless install. So ladies, let's, let's get into the unit. So first and foremost, I think I'm on the fence whether it's big hair friendly or not. So just like I read, it can be a glueless install and you guys already know there's no lace and it's just an adjustable strap. Now I'm not a big fan of adjustable straps just because they always are just a little too tight on my head. So I think that's what's making it uh, tight on my head or whatever. However, I'd rather it be tight on my head just because there's no lace to glue this wig down and it's no way of really securing it on your head without the adjustable strap. So I mean, it's just, I mean, you get you get what you get, you guys. So you want an easy, quick, on-the-go hairstyle. So it is going to have to be a little snug because you don't want it to blow off. So I'm just on the fence, but it doesn't hurt my head um, as much. So I will say that it doesn't hurt my head as much. Um, and I think if you don't wear the adjustable strap, it's still wearable. Just don't wear it on a, a windy day so it doesn't blow off and or use the combs to put it um to put through your hair so it will be you know just firm on your head and just you know very secure so with that being said let's get into the texture of this unit so the texture of this unit y'all is just real really fluffy um i wanted to say mm, like a just like it feels like a natural hair like maybe like a three 3B, 3C type hair and just one, not one curl, girl, uh, flexi rock curl is kind of what it feels like. It's not like slippery hair or whatever. The texture is just really soft. It's very full and thick. It has a slight coarse feel to it. And you know, I like that because it makes it what it, uh, the fullness there makes the fullness there be there or whatever. So yeah, I like that. You can run your finger straight through it. I haven't received any shedding or anything like that. However, I don't want to run my fingers completely through it just because I don't want the curl pattern to just, you know, be lost. Even though I don't think that it will happen because the curls are um, in there pretty good or whatever. And I love that you can just fluff it out and it does get bigger. It does get a little uh, slightly frizzy, but that's to be expected because you are, you know, putting your fingers through it and fluffing it out. It's really just like your natural hair, you guys. And I just love it. It's very bouncy and flowy and just overall nice, you guys. I would say if you want the curls to like be really fluffy and just out there like that. Um, I would probably add some um, got to be glue free spray or some, some type of holding spray just to hold it because the hair is just very soft and flowy that it does move or whatever. So it's not going to technically stay in that big state uh, without some type of holding spray. But I really love that the curls in, in the wig is just very bouncy and full. Again, it's the 200 grams and 180% density. So y'all, the wig is just very full. Um, 
you don't have to trim it the curls the ends aren't frizzy excuse me the ends aren't frizzy at first when i first looked at the wig i thought that the curls were um a little frizzy just because it was matted underneath the netting um, that it came in but once you get it all out of the netting and fluff it up a little bit the curls aren't frizzy at all it's a really uh, some really nice hair you guys um, so yeah the wig overall um, is very secure on my head I will show you guys what it looks like underneath so I'm not sure well you guys already know I have a big head so I'm not sure of what wig cap size that I would get because when I get these units I kind of don't pick out my wig cap size and they either fit me or they don't um so yeah and I'm not even sure of the circumference of my head to be for real for real but um medium it is medium and I don't I don't know if you have a choice let me see let me go in here and see if you have a choice of what wig cap size you want so no you don't have a choice of what wig cap size but again y'all I think that it's good that it's snug just because you do want the security that it's not going to blow off. But back to what I was saying. So you do have this part right here. If you do have a big head like me, you will be able to see your wig cap. I don't think that if the wind blows, it's going to blow this off my head because again, it is fitting snug on my head. Um, so I am entrusting that it's not going to go anywhere. You may or may not see my wig cap if the wind blows or whatever. If it blows up like this, you're, you're going to see it but just depending on how um, hard the wind is blowing but i mean it is what it is if the wind blows i'll just go like this just to make sure you're not able to see my wig cap but that's what it's looking like underneath and i kind of didn't want the curls in my eyes um and i did like you guys saw i put some clips right there just to push it back a little bit because the hair is longer if you want to cut it you can but i don't know i'm i don't think me personally i never put the wig on the same way like i put it on this way today and then tomorrow it may be a different way you get what i'm saying so if you cut it you have to put it on precisely the way you put it on the first time and with me girl that never happens it's always a different way so girl i'll cut it and it'll be a mess so so I rather just not cut it and rather just put the pins in there so yeah you guys overall I really love the curls I love the bounciness the wig is just really pretty you guys again I'm just gonna have to get used to it just because I'm not used to the tight curls um, over my, on my head like this but y'all it's cute girl it's really cute this is giving me like vacation hair hence why i got the flowers and the earrings on because this is really giving me like some vacation type vibes but yeah you guys this is the wig i'll have it linked in the description box below if you guys want to get your hands on it don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will catch you guys in my next video bye